Icon Radio sasa inatamba Turkana 97.1 FM inasikika ludwa na viunga vyake Mina ndoa ekiwonese FM Ekia kwa radio Kwangu zambi kuficha popote ulipo 97.1 FM Ekia kwa radio Upweke kwangu sima zi 97.1 FM Ekia kwa radio Upweke kwangu sima Señorita, it's nice to meet ya. Girl, can I know ya? You know that I need ya. You know that I miss ya. Can you connect? Fine boy from Nigeria. Asante sana. Na kupenda wewe. Give me love, make you give me love. Give me touch, baby, give me touch. Baby, please go love for me. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Tunaenda kupata Liverpool versus Arsenal siku ya leo. Iko mtatolewa leo. Nasikia kati ya Arsenal Liverpool kuna mtu atateso siku ya leo. Naitwa Eve Community Shield Nitakuwa na kuja kupokea simu yako kwa muda sio kwa mrefu lakini natotoka kutoka kwa kwangu sasa hivi mimi nakukaribisha kabisa karibu nyumbani kwangu ama karibu kwangu mimi nakukaribisha nakukaribisha kabisa kwenye mjengo mtu kwangu tunaipiga mpaka mida bibofu itakuwa ni mida gani hiyo Mara tusianza pale mida mibichi tunaipiga mpaka mida mibofu inakuwa ni saa ngapi? Sana dakika 20 hadi mchanika tangu fike mida hiyo. Alafu kama kaida kama ibada interesting na tisa Agosti mwaka pamba ile shirini. Ni show moja inatambulika na kubalika kaunti Turkana inakuwa ni gani? Inakuwa ni moja. Hipi hii. Hakuna show kama hii kaunti Turkana mtu kwangu. Ni hii moja tu. Hata ukijaribu kufanya zile 1 2 3 4 za kwako inakuwa ni moja pekee inatambulika kaunti Turkana inakuwa ni moja tu. Ikifika weekend Ndio show na itegeanga kabisa mtu kwangu ikifika sane Mbona ukiangalia kwingine hivi hata nikikupatia ruhusa sasa hivi unapata kwamba hakuna kitu huko. Huko alishafunga. Wanasikiza moja pekee ndani ya 97.1 FM Kiko Radio. Hata wanajua ni moja tu ikifika hizi mida. Ndio tisho kubwa. Hata ifo ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Married single. Na wale wengine kabisa mjio yangu kwenye mjengo paka mpaka zile midai mibofu itakuwa ni saa 7 sasa Afrika Juma Shuriki wakati DJ kama atachukulia mida mibofu inakuwa ni mida mibichi alafu apige mpaka mida mibofu inakuwa ni saa 10 alafu kama kaide kama ibada chegema atakuwa anachukua mida mibofu inakuwa mida mibichi anaipiga mpaka saa moja usiku hata hivyo siku ile mtu kwangu mpango mzima inakuwa ni kubwa sana yani program ya siku ile ni kubwa the long awaited shows buka sikikunga Saturday pale inakuwa ni show moja tu Zili hindi zile show zikifikanga weekend hakuna mtu anataka kukosa karibu kwangu The meantime kwenye show mtu kwangu utakuwa unafahamisha mingi zaidi kuhusu yule mama ambaye aliweza kupata watoto wanne na kisha baadaye mama huyu akaaga alipata watoto wanne kibungu Mungu pale akangukia watoto wanne four children lakini baadaye pale mama pale akaaga dunia so utakuwa unakumenda na kufahamisha mingi zaidi kuhusu hiyo Na kuna yule mbaya ambaye unazidi kuingiaangia kwenye mitendo za kijamii zimekana kwamba Nasema tio nimbe kwamba ti singa slay shut down claims to be dead. So nitakuwa nafahamisha mengi zaidi kama ni ukweli ama ni uongo ama tu ni mbaya wa mtendo za kijamii. Maana zili trend pale kwenye Twitter, kwenye Instagram pale. Sasa inaangalia kwenye mtendo wa kijamii kwamba Na zile story ambazo zinasemekana kule nje tu kwamba 
Asley, yule msanii wa Koko, yule msanii wa kama angekuwa, yule msanii wa Mimi ngoma mengi sana. So kuna ile story ambayo inazungumzwa sasa hivi tukomba. Mana kuna mtu ali fake pale death yake. So tukao najua kama ni ukweli alikuwa amefake kama ni uongo. Na asile mwenyewe ana nini la kusema siku ya leo. So tukao tutaangalia angalia. Mana ilipostiwa pale kwenye mtandao wa kijamii ikasemekana kwamba ati kifo cha asile cha stua watu wengi sana. So tukao tunaangalia in the meantime. Alafu kisha nafahamishwa kwamba ati breaking news taarifa mbaya sana kuhusu msanii Asile Shaga dunia. So tutakuwa nafahamisha mengi zaidi kuhusu hiyo. Irizwa Riz na Nike Kondo. Na pia kwenye issue mtoko wangu wale ambao wanapenda kuwatch zile movie ya Black Panther ama Black Panther pale. Ni kuna story yenyewe kidogo mtoko wangu lakini ni story ya kusikitisha sana. Bana our favorite actor ni anu huyu. Tutakuwa nafahamisha mengi zaidi bana siku ile pale ametuacha. So tutakuwa nafahamisha mengi zaidi kuhusu hiyo. Na kwenye issue mtoko wangu tutakuwa na wishia mtoto wawili watatu pale happy birthday. Na kwenye issue mtoko wangu tutakuwa napiga gumso na nani? Na kwa jina Jirani anani mada Mama ololo Na kwa jina Faith Stan mtoko wangu tutakuwa napiga gumso na yemla usio kwa mrefu kwenye studio. So mtoko wangu hapana kosa hizi. Alafu in the meantime pia kwenye show tutakuwa napata vocal yako credit yako. Alafu kwenye show mtoko wangu unapata zile fursa ya kuniambia siku ile ungependa tuzungumzie nini. So nakupatia kabisa fursa ya kwako mtoko wangu kusema kile kitu ambacho iko ndani ya ndani ya moyo wako. Alafu tutakuwa tunazungumza mengi zaidi kuhusu hiyo. Na in the meantime pia kwenye show karibu karibu yangu. Itakuwa ni wajanja pale mida, kuna zile mida ya swali la kizushi na swali la kizushi mtoko wangu itakuwa ni inahusu wale watu wajanja kabisa. Kama ni mjanja mtoko wangu nasikiza kipindi hiki hii itakuwa ni yako. Maana nitakuwa napatia vitu viwili pale utofautishe. Kama kuna utofauti kati zao ama kati yao ama kuna utofauti. So in the meantime kuna mambo mingi sana tutakuwa tunazungumzia paka zile midambi bofu itakuwa ni mida sawa wa Afrika ya Mashariki alafu pia nitakupatia zile fursa mtoko wangu nipatie zile request kwako so hapana kosa hii hata hivyo nataka tucheze kidesso deso pale nikichukua simu mbili tatu pale nataka nichukue simu mbili tatu ya Kondo Radio 0796966168 coming back in a short moment itakuwa nachukua simu yako sio kwa mrefu Tunapenda. Eh tunapenda vitu vya bure bure pale kidesto to desto. Simu yako zinatoka sehemu ipi tulikana na kaunti ya Kiko Radio? Yeah yeah baba la baba. Baba la baba ndani kwenye mjengo mtoko tunapiga mpaka mida mibofu. <laughs> kabisa kabisa kikali hapa nipo ndani ya The Eat. Ndani ya The Eat pale ya kikali. <laughs> kabisa kabisa. Ingia malao. Ndio chama lao kabisa. Ati the hit ni chama lao. Ndio ndio kabisa na Zedi wenyewe baba lao. Ushasema baba. Ushasema baba. Kabisa. Ingisha watu wanne hivi kwenye mjengo dadi. Acha niingize Patel Kakadero pale. Niingize watu wote wa Morogoro ndani kabisa kwa mpigo. Iko mtu anashangaa. Iko mtu anashangaa Morogoro ni wapi bwana? Morogoro ni kambi mpya huko bwana. Kabisa. Thank you so much bro. Fresh. Asante. Ekeko radio. Ekeko radio. Hello. Vipi mkuu? Vipi mkuu? 
Wilberforce. Ikiwa kwa radio karibu sana kwenye mjengo dadi. Ah, asante. Anaitwa nani huyu? Niko na Naitwa Wilberforce. Wilberforce. Ah. Safi kabisa. Thank you so much Wilberforce. Karibisha watoto wanne hivi dadi. Nataka niingize Kiru. Mhm. Niingize Junior. Mhm. Alafu chachia hao wimbo ile Madilu Sister River. Nani huyo? Madilu System River. Safi lakini bado time ya request dadi nitakuwa nafanya vile in the meantime. Wakati wa request. Ikiwa kwa radio. Ikiwa kwa radio. Ikiwa kwa radio. Ta. Sa. Thank you so much for tuning and listening to Ikiwa kwa radio. Kama kiene kama ibada ni show moja na inakita kama mizizi kama tu tutukane Ikiwa kwa radio. Eh. Mambo vipi mkuu? Bora. Karibu sana kwenye mjengo dadi. Na karibia ba courses. Anaitwa nani mheshimiwa? Andre Erika lakini amemerikson. Oh Erikson. Eh kutoka kakimat. Kakimat upande wa Kerio. Kakimat maana ya Kerio. Ah. Hizo place na changanyanga sana kakumat bana. Kakimat na hapa Kakimat. Safi mimi nataka nitembee huko siku moja dadi. Ah nimekaribisha bana. Tangu tangu ni nikwambia ukuje. Nikikuja huko mbusi yangu na Sara Blessed. Eh kuja na Sara Blessed. Eh. Na ita na yuko vitu. Eh. Na ndo tenda DJ ya kam. Eh. Iko mbuzi? Ah mbuzi ni ngamia tu. Ngamia? Ngamia ndio sasa. Safi nitakuwa nakuambia siku gani nitakutoka kuja. Sawa. Thank you so much. Nitakaribisha wa Safi. Safi kabisa. Ah just feel better. Eh eh. Just feel good. Eh eh. Kada ngi just feel better. Eh eh. Ah hakuna na kuja. Eh eh. Ah kule load wa mala hizo amezewa na changaza mbarabara na marebeka. Eh eh. Rebeka ndio changaza mbure na ni local mara. Eh eh. Ah pale load wa kuna kuli. Eh eh. Safi kabisa Asanti sana Thank you so much bro Mm. Watu wa Kerio pale ni watu wazuri sana bwana. Nasikia kuna mbuzi ya Sidi Wine. Na DJ Akam. Anthony the Menta. Sara Blaze. Alafu ni sikia wale wengine lakini sawa. Yaani mbuzi itakuwa watu tatu peke yake. Hata hivyo thank you so much. Iko kwa radio. Hello. Mambo vipi mimi? Niko poa. Aitwa nani huyu? Ni Melissa kutoka Kerio. Melissa kutoka mimi ya Kerio. Eh. Ah tuni naye mama. Niko ndani ya show. Eh. Ningekuwa natana kugotia watatu ama wawili hivi. Usibakisha ta mmoja mami. Eh. Nagotia Evelyn from Akuti. Eh. Nagotia Gladys Kaipa from Kerio. Eh. Then Valentine from Kerio. Eh. Nagotia my lovely dad na mom from Eldoret. Wow. Eh. And then Nagotia Echo Bizo from Makero Radio. Eh. Na wengine wote ambao wanabudika katika show. Safi. Eh, sawa. Tukikuja Kerio tuwekee masoda. Eh? Tukikuja Kerio tutawekea soda. Wewe kwa masoda ziko. Eh. Pia mbuzi. Eh. Mimi kila kitu mkikuja samaki. Eh. Tutaorganize vizuri sana. Osha sema bwana. Eh. Thank you so much. Tunawakaribisha Kerio. Safi. Sawa. Hata vile tukizidi kuingia kwenye mjengo mtu wangu tunampenda sana Sara Blaze na Sara Maraka pale. Siku ile mtu wangu namtoa niliuza pale Sara ameenda wapi? Siku ile tafadhali mtu wangu siju tumwambie vipi tumwambie mtoto wetu vipi? Maana pale mimi nimeumii sana. Yaani tukutangu tuachane pale on Saturday last week pale. Shetani akakuja akamwandama pale akampatia magonjo magonjwa lakini tunajua kwamba yote utakuja ikawa sawa. Sara Blaze ndani ya Kiko Radio ndani ya hit pale tunakutakia afueni. Na mimi ningependa pale wale mashabiki sugu ya Kiko Radio pale wamtakie Sara Blaze pale. Kwa hiyo dakika 2 pale isigonge 40 nitaka tumuishie pale uh, Sara Blaze kama Sara Maraka pale tumuishie nini afueni nzuri. Ama quick recovery pale kwa Sara Blaze. Takuwa mzuri maana yaani tunaishi ile upendo wetu kwake. Tumbie kwamba hata tunamwombea Mungu apone haraka haraka ndio ikifika sasa ya kesho tusikuje tena tukamkosa ama vipi Kiko Radio? 
Yo 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 baba la baba. Yes bro. Yeah. Okay, kale hapa. Sema vipi? Eh uh, ningependa kumuishia afueni haraka sana uh-huh. mwanadada Sara Bless. Uh-huh. Apone haraka tukutane next Saturday tukutane ndani ya show. Wewe unamwambia nini sasa hivi? Kama anakuwa nasikia radio, wewe unamwambia nini sasa hivi? Ambia, anamwambia tu namtakia afueni haraka. Eh. Mm, tuko naye tu tunasimama na yeye uh-huh. kila hatua. Eh, Safi kabisa. Kabisa. Utapelekea hata matunda bwana. <laughs> Ekeko radio. Karibu sana mjukuu wangu dadi. Safi kabisa. Safi, thank you so much. Safi kabisa, zimekana kwa mtoto wetu Sara Blessed pale hatapona katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Ifa basi kutoka bidii show pia. Watu bidii pale. Mtu zeni hapo mwele mwe muangalia hapo kwa market muangalia te hata nini bwana. Kwani mwezi chukua hata fruit pale umpatieni eh na madawa pale. <laughs> Lakini najua kabisa utakuwa nafanya vile. So Sara Blessed pale quick recovery utapona katika jina la Yesu Kristo. Sasa shangao nadhani CD wai najui Mungu lakini utapona. Nina imani utapona. Hata hivyo, thank you so much for tuning and listening to Kiko Radio. Nitakuwa nakuja muda usio mrefu kwa kuchangamkia zile SMS za kwako zidi kusikiliza Kiko Radio uh, station moja county ya Turkana. Rosalina tan 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 pum 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 dakika uh, dakika ni 45 mchana nika tangu fike mid ya saa 4 sasa Afrika ya Mashi ndani ya pibadhi ya mtu kwangu kiko radio Hello mambo vipi Ana ngote wawili Usibakisha hata moja dadi Na baza na baza dakika moja Eh Karibisha Ana ngote koli Eh kwa kama eh uh-huh. ndao gotea eh uh-huh. mesa kama eh uh-huh. ndao gotea nini mama bebe au metosha ba eh metosha safi kabisa Sauti yako iko chini sana kwa nini dadi? Ya netwa, nani huyu? Eh, nikaanza kama hivi. Mm. studio tuzungumze baada ya baadaye pale. Eh? Nitachukua namba yako sasa tuzungumze. Sawa. Safi kabisa. Kiko radio. Kiko radio. Safi. Thank you so much. Right, ndani ya pibadhi ni mtu kwangu kwenye SMS line fasta fasta tuangalie angalie nani anataka anataka tumuishia pibadhi ni fasta fasta pale. Nasemekana pale kwenye mtandao kijamii jamii pale kuna huyu msanii anakuwa jina IB1 the lyrical Mr. Kaivi. Nasemekana kwamba siku ya leo anasherekea pibadhi ya kwake. Right, thank you so much IB1 lyrical Mr. Kaivi. Asante uh, sana. Date make for hypothetical days. Siku ya leo basi anazaliwa ana, siku ya leo safi kabisa. Hivyo basi mtu kwangu ndani ya Kekon Radio Tisina saba mtu moja FM aswa the heat pale kikon e kikon heat pale said you wanna set up place na kuishia pale happy birthday pale lyrical mr kaifi ib1 good morning said you eke ya ulunga hajai kutoka kaitese na perusha pale siwezi tukua simu yote siwezi tukua simu yote sasa hivi mtu kwangu 
Nataka tuchangamke chambia simezi kisha tungina ni apipathi di pale uh, Eke ye ulunga jai kaitua kutuwa kaiteze ni peperusha Wawili watatu vero joy zumami party uh, Babu mbapo mwoje na wasikilizaji wote kikon radio Thank you so much Nasema po nye simezi line Nasema vipi Oya oya shoko juto sana Ni sami wa soeto Na gote yu ni hikali na ufunzi wote kikon radio Quick recovery to Sarah Blaze Thank you so much Nimeja aja ndani ya mjengo kashike kashike moto ile mbaya sana ni Dagi G Dagi D they were nani they were nani boy all the all the way from Lapu thank you so much Nasema hapo hivi Zidi wine show na bamba tu sana ni the me, the menta number aba JJ ya Diamond Platinum safi kabisa Nasema hapo hivi ni mimi Maz M, uh, MC Clan MC Ilan hapa na wasikilizaji uh, na wasikilisha Junction I salute you Aki okay, show you kunashika vinuma sana keep it up uh, bro thank you so much nasema hapa hivi okay. ni diba finest kutoka na appetite pale na ameandika appetite uh. kutoka appetite pale city niko locked in kwa mpigo thank you so much nasema uh. hapa hivi kwenye smith line show kwa juto sana sidi wine uh, iko shwari kabisa na kibebe uh, aki uh, na kibebe akiwa loima thank you so much na kijiji na kibebe uh, gotea ito nani huyo kijana wetu mrefu wakati boys alikuwa anaitwa nani uh, iko jina yake mlikuwa tumea naye kitambo huyo Mrefu sana waloima Mgote sana huyo Haita ben top Mgote sana ben top <laughs> Asema Ota the serikal Nafatilia show Thank you so much Asenti sada Asema hapa hivi Happy birthday Hashtag happy birthday Pangali Thank you so much Right Ata for ladies and gentlemen Boys and girls Taka tu tuwekewa wili wa tatu ngoma ya ngoma ya happy birthday mara tumeingia ndani ya happy birthday dakika satano sikifika hivi tutakuwa naingia na uh, faith stand uh, the it maker for majirani mtu alishangaa sasa hii wine faith stand ni msanii mgani huyu cha ni kuwekea ngoma ambaye ni hit song yake ngoma ambaye wengi waliipenda uh, tangu itoke pale labda watu nasikia ngoma unajua ngoma lakini unajua uh, ngoma ya msanii hii ndio ngoma ya msanii ambaye tulikuwa tunazungumza ni one on one mdo sio kwa mrefu Tutaki yote, tutaki hisiza yote mtu kwa angu So mtu kwa angu tukona zugumza na Faith Standa Mdo siwa kwa mrefu, one on one kupitia keko nredio Tisina saba mtu mwoji FM Tutaka kujua mingi zaidi kuhusu jirani Jirani ambaye meteka Faith Standa Mtoto wa kike, mtoto mwenye sampuli ya kupigia mifano pale Toto mzuri fuki mwangalewa kwenye mtunewa za kijemi pale Enda angalewa kwenye mtunewa kwa Instagram pale Faith Standa Mtoto mzuri sana uwe Tukona piga gumbso ya mdo siwa kwa mrefu Mdani keko nredio tisina saba mtu mwoji FM Alafu, wengi wakani famisha pale, CD1, ukua metupomis pwane tukua na usungumza na Simple Boy, the hit maker for Miyadarati So mtu kwangu wache tuairishe iyo ya nani, ito Simple Boy, mpaka next nani, next Sato Mana taka pia pigi gumbso na Sara, mana sikia unajuana na Sara, ito ST4 Simple Boy, sikia unajuana na Sara, utapigi gumbso na Sara <laughs> Next is that I keep on a part of the bigger gums of Mongolia. I tell you, ladies and gentlemen, to go pick a gums of Savi and now fade the stand, Satana Camille. I love Moya Comio to Konagia, Dania to Piana near to Konagia with Jungle, to go in a DJ and Jesha, at a corner for Nikidogo, Will Matatu, and then a corridor to smoke to Moya Fem, DJ and Jesha, at a corner in here, Satana Camille. Some to Congo to number Mings and Akuzungo Sikile, some to Kuma Panaches and Bali, Hata Ifo, to get an epibody di Pale, to no Makea, Hitonani. Atuwaike happy birthday palaso Tukisho tufungi awamu ya happy birthday Oh yes, thank you so much pale. Happy birthday to kwa kila mtu ambaye anasherekea uh, happy birthday siku ya leo. Yaani mtu ambaye mtu wetu yule ambaye amesalia siku ya leo mtu kwangu. Hadi leo moja kwa moja kupitia kwa radio 97.1 FM. Tunakutakia kila laheri uh, siku ya leo ukisherekea. Celebrate with your friends, uh, celebrate with your, with your family. You had one more year. 
miaka katika miaka yako mtu kwangu tunakutakia kila laheri uh, na mtu kwangu uh, kama ulikuwa unafanya mambo fulani kitambo so badilika sasa hivi kwa uh, sababu umesalia upya so badilika vizuri kabisa kama kitambo tu so kwa tabia fulani so wakati una, unabadilisha una, unasalia siku ya leo watu badilike kabisa katika maisha yako alafu mambo itakuwa fresh mambo itakuwa ni mzuka mambo itakuwa ni yente yente hata hivyo ladies and gentlemen dakika nne zimebakia tu uh, zigonge mida ya saa 5 wakati uko unapiga gumso nae nani for the stand na ni kekon radio sikio yana lipi kutambia kekon radio Inakuwa je, kwa je CDY? Shia vipi? yangu tu ni koshwari hapa Zenza Hendian Field unajua ni jamaa wanakwenda kwa jina Papa Magufuli. Papa Magufuli. Ah leo umesababisha bwana CDY huku tu tunatulia tu chini ya muti tu nikunyanyanyonya uji tumemaliza jerkan tano tu hizi kwa sababu jeu yako ni moto sana kama pazi. Osha sema bwana. Eh bwana CDY. Eh. Hebu ngote uje bwana kwa jina CD. Magufuli, wewe ni yule Magufuli yule wa Tanzania, rais. Ah, ah wewe unatoka na county papa Magufuli nafanya makamuzi. Jamaa mbaya anafanya makamuzi. Hapa ni nafanya makamuzi hapo Red Kehon. Safi kabisa, wapatia wili watatu tusikie wanalipa wa kutumbia siku ya leo. Eh, buraku. Vipi mkuu? Shatuweka pale. Thank you so much. Ati vimtu kwangu zimekea dakika tatu tukona ngima dukani kisha tukitoka madukani mambo yatakuwa moto hapa ifinda ni Kikon Radio 97. Dr. Moja FM. Sichize mbali. Thank you so much. 
Dwa lungi dia teker pale Thank you so much kazi nakunu kwa jina Magu pale kazi mefanya nani Lobo pale mefanya kazi nsuri sana Thank you so much Tewala sikizi ya kikon radio Tisina sabang tumoji FM Tukeza pale na zile Zile mbamba abali kwa mifamisha mengi zaidi Tukona sikiza nani kikon radio Siku ya leo The CEO wa Safi Media Atakona kwa jina Diamond Platinums Siku ya leo Atakona fanya VP Siku ya leo atakona sababisha Amaineo ya wapi hapa na jita uh, katika ukumbi wa wapi Jamuri Stadium pale si Kenya Jamuri Stadium pale Tanzania uh, tutakuwa nafanya vya kwake Dodoma uh, siku ya leo uh, mambo itakuwa ni mambo gani katika usiduzi rasmi ya kufanya ni ya kampeni za mapinduzi ya nani ya pombe magufuli CCM pale utakuwa nafanya vya kwao zile entertainment pale utakuwa napata ndani utakuwa napata maeneo ya Jamuri Stadium right Thank you so much. Hiyo ni mambo ya siasa za kwao watakuwa nafanya vile. Of the meantime pale information mengi zaidi kuhusu uh, jita ujamaa jita aitwa Chadwick Boseman pale ambaye ni actor wa Black Panther star actor. Mtu kwangu kwa leo wapenzi wa, wa movie za Black Panther ile anaitwa nayo mtoto ajita Cha nani huyu? Right, thank you so much. Mtu kwangu ulikuwa anaziangalia pale mtandao wangu wa kijamii. Lupita Nyong pale ambaye kwenye movie pale wa Black Panther alikuwa kipenzi chake. Waliact kama mpenzi wa nani? Jo anaitwa Chadwick Boseman pale ametuacha siku ya leo. Ndipo pia wana pale wa naona pia ma, mafanzo wa Arsenal pale na wachezaji wa Arsenal pale wamefanya one sign ya anaitwa nani anaitwa Chadwick ya kuweka mikono miwili pale kama msalaba ama X pale wakisema kwamba rest in peace Chadwick Boseman Chama na pale Jagu pia kwenye mtandao wa Instagram pale sema kwamba uh, amemwambia kwamba amesema kwamba rest in peace Chadwick Boseman yani the king Buka mikuwa kipigene na Colon Kanza Since uh, mwaka alfambili kumina sita in 2016 Paka saivi uh, Paka siku ya leo mtu kwangu mikuwa kipigene na uh, Gonjo wa Kanza Nikuluku jina Colon Kanza Buka kwenye industry pale mikuwa na miaka 43 kwenye industry hata hivyo mtu kwangu Rizwa Riz na yake kwa radio mtu kwangu atuna pale kuna watu baadhi ya watu pale wame kama akina Adams pale kuna pale umetuma rambi rambi zao kwake kwa umetuma rambi rambi zao kwa familia ya Chidwick ito Chidwick Bosman na yake kwa radio pia tunatuma rambi rambi zetu kwa familia ya Chidwick ama kwa mafans wote wa Black Panther pale tunatuma rambi rambi zetu zote kupitia kwa radio 97.1 FM. Hata hivyo siku ya leo uh, kuna kitu nakuruko jina FA Community Shield na siku ya leo mtu kwangu itakuwa ni Champions uh, Liverpool versus Arsenal siku ya leo tutakuwa napiga sijui nani atakuwa na win pale lakini Rizwa Riz na Kekon Radio tutakuwa tunajua wana wote ni Champions. Eh yeah. wana wote ni Champions Liverpool pale alafu tukiangalia pale Arsenal so tutakuwa napiga. So team ya leo pia ni moto tutakuwa naangalia pia line ya Pesiki leo saa ngapi hivi? Kitu kama saa 6 nitakuwa nakufahamisha line ya Pesiki leo ni kama gani na gani. Alafu uh, kama wale wako bet pale tutakuwa naangalia prediction yao itakuwa ni gani. So mtu kwangu sicheze mbali kila kila wakati kila muda sikiza kiko radio 97.1 FM. Kwa hiyo story ambayo sasa ilikuwa nafahamisha mingi zaidi kuhusu kiko radio. Ndani kiko radio hapa hivi. Kuna hii story hapa hivi. Kuna hii story hapa hivi ya Asley 
Slay pale ameshangaa watu wataka kumuua wakati yako hai pale. Maana kuna media fulani inakuwa kwa jina media fulani anajiita anajiita imeli anajiita Mungu jina anajiita G Media alafu mna mautamu alafu TCRA Tanzania ambao waliweza kupeleka habari kwamba eti Asley msanii ashaaga dunia pale. Na asilie kupitia mtandao wake wa Instagram waliweza kusema kwamba nasikitisha na kushangaza sana unaweza kumzushia mwanadamu mwenzako kifo na mabaya mengine wanaofanya hivi ni Watanzania wa kawaida kama sisi ambao tulitamani watupe habari na burudani na wao wanapata risiki lakini kwao bize kutupotosha na hata kuharibu majina yetu. So asilia aliweza kuandika hivyo na kisha akaendelea kusema kwamba anaomba sana kina TCRA Tanzania wasije kusichukulia hatua online TV kama au G Media na Mautamu makanjaja wengine waliopotosha umma na akasema kwamba ana imani kwamba TCRA jeshi la polisi na mamlaka nchini uh, mamlaka nchini Tanzania wataweza kufanya vile watu kama hao wakiachwa wanachafua taswira nzima ya vimbe vya habari ili maisha kwamba Asley bado yuko hai na yule ambaye pale ni shabiki suge kwa wa, wa Asley hiyo tu ilikuwa ni mambo ambaye watu waliweza kufanya fanya vya kwao pale kwa kisha atasema kwamba ati Asley ameaga dunia ndona ni chuki gani iliendelea pale mpaka media za online TV zikaingia ndani kusema kwamba ati asli amekufa lakini hata hivyo asli bado yuko so mtu kwangu chunga pia media zikudanganye ziku zile wa kina Facebook akina Twitter akina Instagram pale msikize kiko radio tutakuwa na ujuzi mengi zaidi maana hii ni halali ndio ukweli tu nchini Turkana ama sijui kaunti ya Turkana ndio ukweli ba Mboka pia inasemekana kwamba si asile tu peke yake. Alishai alishaifikiwa death yake. Inasemekana kwamba Diamond Platinum pia, I love JD pia na Professor J washapitia kitendo kama hicho. Za watu maniu. Baadhi ya watu fulani kudanganya kudanganya umma ati kwamba umekufa. Mengi zaidi nitakuwa nakuja mlezo kwa mrefu sikilize kiko radio tunaingia madukani kisha tukitoka madukani mambo yatakuwa tofauti ndani ya 97.1 FM msicheze mbali Toka midami bichi paka midami bofu toteka anga Ya nilizo tunamsikiza ZD Wine Can you call it? Can you call it? You're right here right now. It's a boy King Sala chilling out with Star Blaze on City Wine. I think you're on hits. Ayo VP Manze ni somebody hapa nikiwa lockdown ya Kio Con Hits nikiwa na Sara Bless na Sedi Wine. Yo yo what's happening? This is Dr. Fladeligan representing Sedi. Kio Con FM bad settings. Thank you so much. Nataka DJ Jech pale kidogo ashikishike pale. Alafu baadaye baadaye pale nitakuwa namwacha. Atakuwa napiga gumso na Faith Stan mdogo sio kumrefu. Hata hivyo DJ Jech tafadhali fanye vile kwako kidogo tu. Alafu baadaye baadaye tuko tunaingia kupiga gumso na DJ Jech. Pata an interactive an interactive mix hapa hivi ndani ya Kiko Radio 97.1 FM. Chai, chai. Ah. I got a lie in 
atukai sana Atukai sana Jasa jasa Atukai sana Cool my temperature Some the good, some the good Baby, Ati for ladies and gentlemen to watch to jaribu kumpigia pale jita stand fight the stand lakini DJ nataka kidogo tu pause alafu twende pa 21st first pale kwa wapi uh, twende unipatie best of nani best of fight stand pale mimi najua kwamba utajaza jaza first first pale nataka tujaribu pale kumpigia uh, tumpigie uh, fight the stand uh, simu kwake alafu twende itakuwa vipi itakuwa fresh mambo itakuwa ni mzuka mambo itakuwa ni yenti twende na hayo Then I cut the my time my time Are you ready for me I ready for this Thank you so much I see Thank you so much I see Shamu na pale account stay gule my cousin for tilipia kipende Shamu na pale ashua na fatilia kipende kutoka maeneo long age pale Shamu na pale across rose shamu na pale my sister Bentan Sunday pale fatilia kipia kipende thank you so much Shamu na pale shamu na watu nazidi kufatilia kipende hiki Shamu na pale watu kutoka maeneo BD shop na fatilia kipende pia thank you so much BD shop Shamu na pale my enough food was him fatilia pia kipende thank you so much Shamu na pale Jay na fatilia kipende pia asin sha kuona simu kwamba kina range kina ishia kina KVB kina ipasi kina yana Akina Okonko Shua na shika vinoma sana Thank you so much Shua na pale Sema ita ipaye kutoko menia JB Fatili pia kipindi Thank you so much Akina Kikali Fatili pia kipindi Akina Baru kutoka Fatili pia kipindi Akina Cliff Thank you so much Sema Cliff na jia Sema kumba Cliff Na mumbia Sarah Blaze Tafueni Thank you so much Shua na pale reaction za watu Pia kusiena na hile story Ya Astelia Sema kumba Chia Astelia mekufa Na hako mekufa Paka asli mwenye wa kachanga mke pale kwenye Instagram kwa sababu kwamba baadhi ya zile media za online TV pale na zile zingine wachukuliwa watu pale. Shabu na pale siasa kwenu pale thank you so much kwa namba changa mke changa mke pale. Nataka tupige fedi stand simu. Nishakubali sikufanya vema. Nitafanya nini kwa kesi mzango. Mwanani ananiwa. Eh. Beba amwenzenu. For one shilling and fifty cents daily. Baga, I like the way you take hold me. Maybe you hear that. Mama Vipi. Poor son. I need to afraid to stand. Yeah. Or else he can't make a career. It's in a suburb to move your film. Uh-huh. Ebu ebu to party. Ebu changa muka to party zile. Mama hola hola. Haha. Tere na yo. Mama hola hola. Jirani anani mada Meji beba Mwanzenu minapagawa Mama hololo Jirani anani mada Meji beba Mwanzenu minapagawa I like the way Uto na nayo I like the way I like the way you look at me Boy gotta come closer I like the way you lick that thing, baby. Can I come over? Me ni kuna taka useme that thing. That thing ni 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 vi mami. Lick that thing. That thing ni ni. Come on, say na waka out. Wajana inwa chuma. Yeah, so I can lick your thing. 
Yeah, I like it. <laughs> Yeah, uh, I mean, he come close. I like the way he looked at me. Karibu sana na Kekorele tena 7.1 FM. Nashukuru. Ini station Turkana. Oh, okay. Na station kubwa sana nasikika kila pahali kama Samburu pale Baringo Stupokot pia. Oh, yeah. One of the best radio station Turkana County. Nice. Karibu sana na Kekorele. Ah, uh, salimia pale mabeshti wako. Uh, salimia pale mafanzo wako na kusikiza hivi. Ah, uh, well, na salimia my family. <laughs> <laughs> My friends all over. Yes, you were mentioned what you watch any wengi. <laughs> yeah, so everybody now kila mtu mwana ni support. Hata when you see juu wenye wani juu wenye si wajui maze na shukuru sana. Exactly. Yeah. Safi kabisa. Uh, Fethi stand. Yeah. Tukiaza vizuri kabisa Fethi stand ni nani hivi? Uh, Fethi stand is a Kenyan female artist. Mm-hmm. Na ringe kwa ni kifanya mziki tangu high school. Mm-hmm. Nikia mdogo and all that stuff but nilifanya ngoma yangu ya kwanza 2016. Mhm. Na nilikuwa nikirecord hadi time nilitoa jirani ikakuwa ika blow. Mm-hmm. You know ikakuwa ni kama ndio breakthrough yangu mm-hmm. na bado naendelea kufanya muziki. Na labda kwa hiyo mtasema kwamba uh, Faith Stan ngoma yake ambayo ilimtambulisha zaidi ilikuwa ni Faith Stan atakuwa amesema uongo. Ati? Nasema kwamba nasema ha. Yeah. Yule mtu sasa ananiambia kwamba aseme kwamba Faith Stan yeah. Ni msanii ambaye alitambulishwa na ngoma ndio kujina jirani. Yeah, jirani ndio ilifanya nikajulikana worldwide I can say. Mhm. Yeah. What, what what is the story behind jirani? Ah uh, well, jirani is a song about uh this neighbor. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Ama mtu yote mwenye mtu anaweza relate. Mtu uh-huh. umekrashia uh-huh. ni au mjui mm-hmm. lakini like umemkrashia na amejibeba like hakuna quality zao unataka. Mhm. Yeah so basically hiyo ndo song about it's about a crush. Mhm. Mtu crushia sana lakini amejibeba mark mm-hmm. that. Mhm. Asante sana. Ona pale kuna baadhi ya watu kwasema kwamba yani yeah. ni ngoma ambayo mtu akisikia uh, aki, akiimba jirani yeah. anamwambia yule yule jirani ambaye yuko karibu na yeye hapo anaishi pamoja. Yeah. So tulikana county <laughs> ni ngoma ambayo inapiga sana huko. Ah nashukuru. Eh paka watu mm-hmm. wanatolea tu machalis pale mimi nikasema kwamba siku moja tukutana na Faith Stan tupige gumso na yeye itakuwa fresh tu. Ah uh, kabisa. Mm-hmm. Fedi stand. Yeah. Saizi kwa msimu wa corona ama kwenye kipindi cha COVID-19 ama corona. Mhm. Wewe unatumia ngaji gani kuhakikisha kwamba at least tunafikia wale mabest wako, mashabiki wako pia, mafans wako pia? Uh, me sometimes na go live. Mm-hmm. Almost every Friday. Naam. So, yo, nikiwa hiyo live na get to entertain mafans wangu. Naam. Hadi nisisauliki. Unajua sasa hivi ni watu wajaenda hivi out, clubs zimefungwa, mashows zakuna. Mhm kwa niki go live bado nafanya entertainment. Wow. Yeah. Santi sana. Na unaweza waambia nini mafans kuhusu COVID-19 ama corona? Eh, hey, corona mzee iki tu iko. So you just have to stay safe mm-hmm. and uh what you sanitize. Mhm. Wow. Oh. Watu sanitize wa keep distance alafu kisha kuzingatia ile serikali inasema. Ambalie mask man. Mm-hmm. Asante yeah. sana. Kuna ngoma yako ilikuwa kwa jina na Rosire. <laughs> yeah. I don't know ni lugha gani. Ah uh, well, you know Kiki C. Uh-huh. Inasema vipi? Yeah. Inamaanisha nini? Na Rossi ni mechoka, it's a heartbreaking song. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's a love, it's a heartbreak song here too. Like na Rossi ni inamaanisha nimechoka na wewe. Uh, labda nani alikuchokesha hivi ama storia ni gani kuhusu <laughs> na Rossi? Ama ilikuwa ni ngoma tu iliamua kutoa? Uh, <laughs> well, ni ngoma zangu zinakunga out of life experience, nature, uh-huh. whatever that I see, nikiwa na kitu. Mhm. Uh-huh wa na 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 yeyeandika ina kwa ina way of song so na rossi really kwa part of my story mm-hmm. i was in a relationship nika break up so i felt like ili ni ili ni guza sana so nikaona the only way na as i pin down Nam. ni kwa through wimbo mm-hmm. na pia, pia a lot of people will relate because mm-hmm. ni kitu ina happen kila kwa kila day at least all right yeah thank you so much labda faith stan ni msanii ambaye kwa ndani management ama anajichezea peke yake tu Manafanya kazi peke yake. Well, saizi ni kona investor, ni kona team na work nayo. Siko sign really, but ni kona team ni megro nayo kutoka mm-hmm. kitambo. Tangu nianze mziki. Naam. So tuna work tu kama team. Right. Yeah. Safi kabisa. Labda kuna kazi na kuna kwa jina namba moja. Yeah. Na hii ni song baada ulitoa ananipenda. Yeah. Ukatoa namba moja. Yeah. Labda sijijua ulikuwa umepangia vipi maana kidogo namba mo- na, au uko umeachia kwanza ananimada pale ifanye fanye kidogo kidogo katu yeah. surprise na namba moja. 
Uh, ah yeah, ya anajua imekuwa imekuwa miezi tatu tangu nipeane jirani. Yes. So nikafili pia unajua muziki azi nilikuwa nimezoesha fans wangu na wapatia ngoma at least every month. Mm-hmm. So jirani nilikuwa nimeipatia at least two the other two months so nikakuwa three months and mm-hmm. it bado inafanya fiti sana. Mm-hmm. Uh, God willing it okay imefika imefika that is one million this year probably. All right. Yeah so nikaamua kufanya namba moja namba no. moja ni kama continuation ya jirani. Mm-hmm. Yeah as in to keep the the YouTube busy cuz mm-hmm. pia lazima add content no. ndo umaintain your account yako. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much. Kuna mtoto anakuwa kwa jina Sara Bless kama Sara Maraka yule ambaye tunafanya naye show anakuwa kwa jina The Hit ambaye sasa hivi uko hewani. Yeah. Ameniambia kwa kipindi hiki cha COVID-19. Mhm. Una pitia changamoto gani hivi? Well, kuna challenges more moja ni ona kuambia tuna shows sasa hivi. Mhm. And uh, yeah like kuna vitu mob like tuko na ngoma kali zenye tumefanya um. lakini tuna feel zinakuwa wasted tukianza mm-hmm. kuzi release as in kwa covid mm-hmm. time mm-hmm. so tuna feel kama bado vitu zingekuwa normal poa naam sasa hivi running ingekuwa mbali unajua you know yes. like cause ningo maflani hit na bado ni ngoma hizi isha lava yake mm-hmm. so na feel ni kama ngoma yangu pato na ilikuwa wasted in a way naam Yeah cuz haijakuwa haijapata ile reception yenye nilikuwa nataka. As much as imeenda bado ingeenda twice that. Naam. Najua. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Safi kabisa. Thank you so much for faith stand pale. I don't know sasa hivi utatusurprise na nini ukitoka kwenye Ewani sasa hivi tutarajie nini kutoka kwa <laughs> faith stand. Uh, well sasa hivi niko na because jirani ilikubalika sana na bado bado watu bado, bado watu wanaiangalia na wanaipenda. Naam. My fans walikuwa wame suggest ni patie ni patie remix. Right na one of the biggest artists so uh-huh. that is what i did nilikuwa nimeo promise wakifika uh-huh. uh-huh. half a million naam hello hello um, i'm dropping a remix very, very soon yes. one of the good artists aha uh-huh. yeah Right thank you so much. Labda tume ni msanii wa Gengeton hivi ama vipi? Maana tunaona sasa hivi wasanii wengi wameamua kucheza na watu wa Gengeton. <laughs> ah hapa 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 so tuni uh-huh. Gengeton. Aha. Uh-huh. Jinsi tu anafanya poa na akona akona fan base. Uh-huh. Yeah. All right. Labda kwa 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 maoni yako. Mhm. Wewe unaona gengeto tunachukuliwa vipi katika jamii? Well, gengeto si, si mbaya lakini uh-huh. ni, ni type of music. Aha. Uh-huh. Kutoka kitambo kulikuwa na na wachaba genge. Sasa uh-huh. sikizi ni kwa gengeto. Naam. But so the, the only bad thing they can get on your squeezy <laughs> is whatever they sing there. Uh-huh. They're too open. Not only kill mtu anasikiza muziki, our parents, our kids and all that stuff. Mhm. Maze wanasikiza ngoma. Mhm. Lakini ukiandika kitu yenye iko too open maze mm-hmm. like sijui nini nini nini. Mhm. Una feel hata mzazi haizi take that kama song. Song kama hizo azidumu. Naam. Alafu pia content kama hiyo haizi utashinda ukimba the same thing kila mm-hmm. time. Mhm. Uh-huh. Yeah. So right. personally I feel like um uh, Gengeton kama wange change mm-hmm. like the type of music is sour but whatever they are singing mm-hmm. they sing at least different things and they try what what try to hide things. Mm-hmm. Yeah, naona kama venye Tanzania at least wakimba kitu kama ni chafu iko na hidden meaning. Yeah. Wana feature in words. So mm-hmm. mtu mkubwa anazelewa lakini mtoto inakuwa ni nzito kidogo. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much pale. Naona kwa sababu ya wakati pale Faith Stan Yeah. Labda tupatie pale mitandao za kijamii pale tuweze kutafuta pale. Uh, well YouTube uh, subscribe kwa channel yangu at Faith no. Faith Tan S T A N. Uh Instagram uh mafanso wangu anaweza ni follow at Faith Tan underscore KE no. that is Kenya. Mm-hmm. And Facebook at Faith Tan double. Na Twitter ni Faith Tan 2. TikTok ni Faithstan underscore KE kama Instagram. Uh-huh. Yeah. Asante sana. Labda maneno yako ya mwisho pale unaweza kuambia mafans nini sasa hivi? Well, mimi na mama fans wazee wasikie pale YouTube, yeah. wasubscribe kwa channel yangu na wangoje notification itakuwa hit after hit. Mm-hmm. Yani kazi kazi. Yeah. Safi kabisa. Thank you so much for your time. Yeah. Tushukuru. Thank you. Tushukuru sana. Okay. Asante kabisa. Right. Shabiki Suge Keko Radio afanye hivi. Una lipi la kumpa la kuzungumza ukitaka kuzungumza basi na Faith Stan first first pale kupitia 0796 96 0796 96 18 96 itakuwa fresh itakuwa mzuka mambo itakuwa ni gente gente. Tukuna piga paka zile midami bofu. Fanye hivi. Piga gumso na sisi hivi.
Kabla sija kupoteza ile line up siku ya leo mtu kwangu. Kwa ile game leo ambayo itacheza siku ya leo ni kwa jina Liverpool versus Arsenal. So mtu kwangu siku ya leo mtuangalie watu wanaubashiru upi siku ya leo. Watu Arsenal mko. Watu wa Liverpool mpo. Alafu na wale wengine kama kina Man U, kama kina Manchester United. Najua sasa hivi kuna timu ambao wanaishangilia wanaishabikia siku ya leo alafu kuna ile wanapinga watu Chelsea pia sasa hivi naona sawa sifuri saba tisa sita tisa sita moja sita moja ndio nane kabla sija kupatia si kabla sija kupatia line up ya siku ya leo umefanya ubashiru wako nijue siku ya leo gani naweza win na gani naweza lose pale kama kupitia game ya leo mtu kwangu nalipi ya kutumbia siku ya leo tatumsikia huyu Kiko Radio. Ah baba baba baba. Mambo vipi dadi? Sawa sana. Tena nayo. Eh na Andre Rika kitoa paka kama. Eh. Ya mbeji ya leo ni ngumu. Eh. Ah ni ngumu sana. Ime cha leo ni ngumu sana. Bori. Wewe mtu kwanza na patia alikuwa kuwi. Eh. Ama wataenda draw mabao mabao ama bila bila bila. Eh. Eh kwa hivyo. Wewe ni mtu wewe ni mtu wa timu gani? Man, man, red devil. Man, man, red devil. Asante sana. Yeah. Shukran. Right, thank you so much. Bado nachukua zile SMS zako first first. Tumsikie Keko Radio. Hello. Mama fupi mkuu. Udonge na Ikaru Mtamu kutoka A Junction Akerio. Ikaru Mtamu. Yeah. Eh, sawa Ikaru Mtamu. Eh, Niki nikiona mechi ya leo kati ya Liverpool na mm-hmm. Arsenal mm-hmm. naona kama Arsenal wanaweza pigwa tatu bila Arsenal wanaweza pigwa tatu bila Huo ni utabiri wangu Haya shukurani sana dadi Haya ni maoni yako napenda sana maoni yako Maoni yeah. maoni yangu kabisa yeah, Sawa <laughs> Haya <laughs> Yaani mtu asana nasikiza saa hizi radio na hataki kuchangamka Eh tunasema kwa roho tutapiga watu tutapiga watu. Si upige simu upige watu basi. <laughs> oh tapiga Liverpool. Sawa. Arsenal utapiga Liverpool. Liverpool utapiga Arsenal. Sijajua. <laughs> My champions wa FA Community Shield pale. Thank you so much Lin. Ile simu kwamba anafuatilia kipindi. Thank you so much Lin. Sasa shamaona pale Spinka Ebay anafuatilia pia kipindi. Thank you so much. Asante sana Spinka. Sema tajiri anasema kwamba anasema anajiita tajiri. Tajiri anasema kwamba tajiri Shadi anasema kwamba Arsenal win. Shadi tajiri kutoka Union Toro na Gotema Demoto ushindi shop. Alafu na bamba tu sana. Gotia sana hapo uh, Mademo ushindi. Akina Faith pe. Akina Faith hapo Mania ushindi shop. Katika kati atukai sana Katika 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 Ayo rostoria flani sasa hivi ni changamke changamke first first pale Kibao kwamba Ati watu wanaanga kwamba kudampu mtu just a easy way I'll get away with it Fahamisho hapa hivyo hivyo Mtu anakupenda na kudampa hapo hivyo Lakini kisha unapewa hapa free advice unaambia kwamba kwa njia kizungu you don't pay girl it is okay yeah, it is okay for you you don't pay girl it is okay but remember someone else will date her and marry her in future you will also date and marry a dump lady and marry her just confuse generation anaambiwa hapa hivi uh, kwamba a confused generation 
you confuse the uh, generation pale if you know you know you confuse generation ni gani you confuse generation ni gani you dump a girl it is okay okay it is okay for you it is okay 100% it is okay but remember someone else will marry her and date her will date her and marry her for her uh, in future Alafu simekana kwamba you also date and marry a dump lady and marry her just a confused generation she want to dance it is what it is You shot the manisha nini? Wewe utapenda mtoto wa mtu mpende vizuri kisha mdump hapo hivyo. Nikumbuka utakutana pia na mtoto wenyewe pia amedumpiwa. Alafu bado utamoa. Yeah. Rizu wa Riz. Yeah. Alafu kuna jamaa fulani ameniambia kwamba sasa hivi atempotee sambusi. So baba, pale pote unasikiza kikorodi sasa hivi na kama uko hapa uko Turkana county, uko lodwa. Uh, kuna ofisi zetu ziko maeneo ya National Oil. Kuna ofisi yetu iko juu maeneo ya National Oil pale. So fika maeneo ya National Oil tutapata secretary wetu. Tutapata ofisi zetu saba utapata ofisi zetu pale National Oil. Orofa ya juu. Alafu natumai kabisa tusaidika pale. Na yule mtu yote yule ambaye anachochote kile ambacho anataka kuzungumza ni Kikon Radio. Ni simple fika sasa hivi siku ya leo fika kwenye ofisi zetu ambazo ziko maeneo ya National Oil. Siku maeneo ya National Oil pale kwenye orofa ya juu. Alafu uliza topo chini Kekon Radio iko wapi? Mbuzi yako umepotea fika pale ambayo itakuwa ni fresh ambayo itakuwa ni mzuka ambayo itakuwa ni gentle gentle. Introducing what? Sasita Africa ya Mashariki. Swali la kizushi ni gani? Itakuwa na kuja kupokea simu za kwako mtu kwangu saa sita kamili ukiniambia tofauti kati ya moyo na roho. Maana fahamishwe hapa mtu anambia kwamba uh, maasema kwamba mtu amekata roho. Mbona isiyo kwamba mtu amekata moyo? Swali la kizushi mtu kwangu itakuwa na kuja kupokea simu za kwako saa sita sasa Afrika ya Mashariki. Mtu amekata roho. Mbona isiyo kwamba mtu amekata moyo? Ambio kwamba ati mtu amekata roho. Badala yake mtu atasema kwamba ati mtu ajekata moyo. Mtu amekata roho. So tofautisha kati ya moyo na roho. Alafu niambie kwamba wakati mtu anambia kwamba mtu amekata moyo ama mtu amekata roho. Tofauti yake ni gani? Tuelewane hapa hivi ni kikoro. Kumbuka hii ni ya wajanja tu peke yake. Kama ni mjanja unajua hii. Sasa sita kamili tutakuwa tunakuja kupokea simu za kwako ndio sio kumridi. Je, fanya vile kwako. Swali la kizushi ya wani Tabia mbaya Swali la kizushi ya wani Sibala yake tuniambia ni kupigia simu kuliko kufunya reverse call Anambia tu nipigia simu kuliko Nandika unatuma reverse call Kuna swali la kizushi ya wani Swali la kizushi ni gani Tofauti kati ya moyo na roo Wanapata kwamba unaambiwa kwamba eti mtu amekata roho badala yake mtu waizi kuambia eti mtu amekata moyo unaambiwa kwamba mtu amekata roho Yeye anaambia ati nimpigie na anatuma ile ya 130 andike SMS yako tafadhali nipigie Grace Tamani thank you so much cha kuona pale Arafatilia show Shadia sema kwamba Arsenal will win So Alex Ushewani alafu kumbuka nitakuwa nakuja pia na na trends mdo sio kumrefu voki akana msha kuona anasema hapa uh, tofauti kati ya uh, ya roho uh, na nini roho na moyo it's the first first pale hi sidiwani kolo na wakaile usiget msikio kiko radio hello namba vipi dadi hapo haito nani huyu yergero hapo anasema vipi Ati, 
Ad. Ni nini? Ni Ad. Ad. Yeah. Asante sana. Gani iko ndani ya nyingine? Shatweka hivyo. Keko radio? Ready. Mamba bebe. Ndio brother bana. Eh. Asije msikie vizuri. Asema pa Kolo kile sige na urusha mabishto wangu wote wawili Kolo tumsikie. Keko radio? Hello. Mamba bebe. Gergero nimerudi tena. Asema bebe. Kona ambe tigani uko ndani. Eh, gani uko ndani ya nyingine? Kende uko ndani ya moyo. Art ndio uko ndani ya moyo. Ah ah. Spirit ndio uko ndani ya art. All right. Asante sana. Safi. Hii ni ya wajanja tu. Keko radio. Keko radio. Hey. Namba vipi? Nakushia hapo kwa mambo ya Jerjero. Kwa mambo ya Jerjero. Yeah, yeah. Safi tutakuwa na kuja. Good luck. Safi. Safi. Keko radio. Yes. Anasema vipi? Eh. Aroni kaa kama kweli spirit. Erika ongeza kwa sauti kidogo. Eh ni Rona ni Amoyo. Mm. Rona kama mtu anasema kwa na Rona ama kwa na spirit ama kwa na kitu yenye ataka. Ana ana chamsha kwa Amoyo. Mm. Ni Rona. Alafu Amoyo ni ni na kwanza kwa mabavu tivi kama hapo. Kwa bidoni kwa kiingereza ni hapo. Mm. Santi Thank you so much Apena sana mauni yako Thank you so much Ro Naitua tofauti ya ro Na moyo Safi Uche tuwende uyu Unasema nini? Akili na kichwa Akili na kichwa Tofauti ni gani Tofauti ni gani Safi Ama Ama ya gizori na maindi tofauti ni gani sawa sara blessed na kili na kili hizo zote itakuwa ni suwe la kizushi ya next sato mbuka suwe la kizushi na kuanga ni suwe la ufala ufala tu hivo yes bro naomba suwe ya tuwe ni vena napasi hmm naomba tuwe ni vena napasi kidogo safi tuwe ni nayo lakini hivyo nye mendada nini bro yetu anasema ati kili na kiki wa hmm Sasa akili sikapo tu ndani ya kichwa. Alafu mm. kichwa ni kichwa nini? Ni kichwa tu yenye tu. Kichwa ni kichwa tu. Kichwa ni kichwa tu lakini akili siko tu ndani ya kichwa. Kichwa ni kwa mabongo ni bonga. <laughs> Asante <Kiko>. sana. Sawa. <laughs> Ekeko radio. Hello. Mambo vipi dadi? Sasa Yes. Eh. Uh. Aji tofauti ya kichwa na akili. Eh. Nafaa kwanza atafakari. Eh. Yeah. Atafakari. Karibu tena, jaribu tena. Wewe unajua? Eh, mimi najua. Safi, utatujibu. Atapata atapata Asante sana. Ina nikumbusha wakati mtu ale aliambia anga kwamba Sediwani maisha ni nini? Mimi nikasema maisha ni maisha tu. Maisha ni nini? Maisha ni maisha tu. Hey. <laughs> Ekeko radio. Hello. Mambo vipi? Ah, poa sana. Tuna nayo dadi. Eh, ni baridi. Eh. Eh, sasa ni bongo tu, ni bongo ni siku wa Jimmy Ro ni Ro. Eh. Eh, lakini hakuna utafauti hii Ro tu inabaki Ro. Eh. Eh, kichwa bongo inabaki na bongo yake brain yake. Mat. Safi, thank you so much. <laughs> Ekeko radio Ekeko radio Vipi mkuu Asha tuweka pale Asha tuwende uyu <laughs> Ekeko radio hey. Mamba vipi Masa hey. Ilikuwa ndaka Nikupe challenge kidogo Unipatia mi challenge Mita si kuambia hey. Kuna room takatifu Eh hey. Na uko na moyo mtakatifu. Eh. Tofauti ni gani? <laughs> Safi kabisa. Thank you so much. Ashatoweka pale. Swala so, like, kizuri zinazidi kuwa mingi pale mtu kwangu. Na tujiingie pale kwenye Rico sitakuwa vipi? Swali la kizushi zimeanza kuwa mingi sana na Kekon Radio hapa hivi mtu kwangu mambo ni mzuka mambo ni yente yente watu wanazidi kuenjoy show mbuka ni show moja kaunti turkana 
Please. Ni show ambayo watu watu ni ngojanga pale ikifika weekend. Wana ngojanga sana. Hii ndio show na ngojanga sana kwa mpigo. Right? Ikiko radio. Hello. Mambo vipi? Sawa. Atofautisha kati ya ro uh, na hiyo ingine. Ro na moyo. Eh. Yeah. Ro ni ro mtakatifu. Mm-hmm. Then moyo ni yenye tunatumia kwa kwa mwili. Mm. Anaitwa nani huyu? <laughs> Sawa. Ikiko radio. <laughs> vipi mkuu? Epo. Yes, tuna nayo. Ta. Mm. Najua hiyo swali. Mm. Ni kama mtu akuulize. Mm. Ya computer na laptop. Mm. Hii ndio inafanya dando gani? Eh. Najua hiyo ni swali. Yaani swali swali la malaga. Mm. Hii ndio swali la kizushi. Eh, ni kama ule msebe alisema. Eh. Najua gani na mind gando gani sio gani. Alafu tena Yeah. <laughs> Na kusikia dadi. <laughs> Tuachi hapo. <laughs> Thank you so much for tuning in listening to Keko Radio. Kumbuka inaikwenda kwa jina swali la kizushi ndani ya 97.9 FM Keko Radio station na itemba na kubaliki counter to Ghana. Lazima kufahamishe kwamba Mchana huu leo wewe kama shabiki suge kiko radio palipoto ulipo pale na ungependa pale kufanya vipi? Ungependa pale uh, kuchukua zile offer za kwako, zile gifts za kuku kutoka Nan Bakery. Fika sasa hivi, si fika siku ya leo. Mchana huu leo fika Nan Bakery. Utapata vya kwako. Alafu itakuwa fresh mambo itakuwa ni mzuka mambo itakuwa ni yenta yente. Kwa ile kidogo ambayo uko nayo sasa hivi enda nua kitu yote pale pale Nan Bakery, alafu utapata offer kwa kusikiliza tu kipindi hiki cha uh, cha The Heat ya kiko radio. Hello. Vipi mkuu? Hapo hasa. Yes. Niko na tege yo komando ba Jerjero man. Safi takuwa na kuja. Alileta ngoma yake hapa. Ni ipi yake album mpya. Safi iko hapa. Ningia jana jana. Uko sure iko hapa? Alileta jana iko. Sawa. Management leta. Safi. Safi. Thank you so much. Ni mimi mchezee ngoma ya komando ba Jerjero. Sawa. Kama itakuwa kwenye albamu ya kwangu nitafanya hivyo. Ikiwa kwenye playlist ya kwangu nitafanya hivyo. Na kama kuna kwenye playlist ya kwangu labda utausikia kipindi ambacho inakuja sasa hivi, labda inaweza kuwa kwenye playlist yao. Itakuwa fit, itakuwa mzuri kama itakuwa ni yente yente. Nipatie request yako kwa kupitia SMS line halafu itakuwa fresh mambo itakuwa ni mzuka itakuwa ni yente yente taka nipate maji na nitatulia sana fanya hivyo kama kuna request yako tumia SMS line ambayo ni 0796961618 andika kupitia SMS line maana ukipiga simu itakuwa ni vigumu pale kupokea simu yako huko na request andika request yako kupitia SMS line 0796961618 yani 0796 961618 Napia tutakuwa tangia kwenye mjadala nikirejerejea baada baada pale lakini introduce mjadala mjadala itakuwa inahusu nini Mjadala wa siku leo mtu kwangu ni mjadala fulani ambaye kwa njia moja ama nyingine bila simu kwamba inatatanisha inashangaza ma vipi Maana kidogo tukianza kusema tu hivi Ikigonga ile midan ta utakuwa na ndakuwa kuja tena kufahamisha mengi zaidi alafu utakuwa unapokea simu ya koko kichangechangia mada ya siku ya leo. Iko hivi. Rajima fulani alipanga harusi na mke wake. Alipanga vizuri harusi na mke wake. Akapanga vizuri kapangika. Lakini shetani akaingia katikati. Defo, shetani akaingia katikati. Mwanangu asimanga kwamba shetani ameingia katikati. Hatujui kama ni shetani ama ni labda ni hisia za mwanamke zilimfanya akajiingiza kwa mbao fulani ambaye sasa hivi nakuambia. Uh, msichana na mwanamke huyu na bwana walikuwa wamefanya walikuwa wamepanga harusi so ilikuwa like kufanya harusi yao ifi karibuni. Lakini mwanamke kwa zile tamaa ya pesa na mali na luxurious things mwanamke akaenda akafanya vipi? Akacheza kwingine, akacheza nje ya ndoa yake. Akona bwana yake vizuri kabisa. Akuna mpenzi wake anampenda vizuri kabisa lakini mwanamke akaenda akafanya vipi akacheza na mpango wa kando na ikasemekana kwamba mpango huu wa kando ambao alifanya pale ilikuwa ni mpango wa kando ya mtu ambaye ameambukizwa virusi vya uh, vya uh, vya karibu sime covid 19 samani ameambukizwa virusi vya HIV and AIDS mwanamke alifanya mpango wa kando na mtu ambaye 
alikuwa amefanya vipi ameambukizwa virusi vya uh, vya HIV and AIDS so bwana yake kupata storia kapata kama mke wake kumbe alikuwa baadhi ya mwanamke ama baadhi ya wanawake ambao walilala na mtu ambaye ameambukizwa virusi vya uh, AIDS nikakuuliza hivi Nani nafanyanga by the way watu ambao wako kwenye ndoa vizuri kabisa. Mtu ambaye kabisa anapenda bwana yake na wanapanga arusi. Mtu ambaye anapanga arusi kujiingiza kwa vitu kama hivi. Sasa hivi pale bwana huyu amepata hata tax sasa hivi ameumizwa kabisa maana yule mtu ambaye alikuwa anampenda sana na akasema kwamba tutafanya naye arusi na yule mtu ambaye ame katika ndoa yake. Na akaenda akacheza kwingine, akacheza nje na ndoa yake. Eti kwa sababu ya zile pesa Luxurious things unataka gari unataka mali unataka vipi au jipenda mume wako vile alivyo